I'm Christy Odom. I'm a wildlife photographer and filmmaker based in Longmont, Colorado. When I got the call to do the Z9 campaign, what I really wanted to do was a piece that highlighted all the wildlife that lives at high altitude, the amazing sounds of the mountains, and I wanted to do something that just really connected people with alpine wilderness. My assignment with the Z9 was to capture some video, 120 frames per second at 4K. So it was really when I looked through the camera and started seeing what it could do, started seeing what it could do with its autofocus, especially for the video work that I do, that I realized that this is gonna take my work to a completely different level. Wildlife is fast. You've gotta be quick, you've gotta be on the move, you've gotta be able to pivot. Now my current love is pikas. I'm so surprised that the autofocus could find the pika's eyes. I mean, we're talking about a tiny, tiny rabbit relative that's like the size of a potato, but it was able to see the eye of the pika and move around with the pika, and I was so excited about that. I love how the yellow belly marmots interact with each other. It's quite beautiful to see a juvenile and a mother. They were right next to each other and I'm sitting there going, oh no, I want both eyes in focus. <laughs> so I turn the camera on focus peaking. Focus peaking kicks in whenever you manually adjust the focus of your camera and you can see where your focus is hitting your subject. Shifted my body in a position where when I saw that bright blue, my focus peaking I always put on blue because I find it to pop the most in nature. When I shift, when I saw that blue line on mama's eyes and on baby's eyes, I ended up getting both of the eyes at like a relatively shallow depth of field, but both of them tack sharp. To be able to go home and download those video files and then see them really big on my screen, it's like I felt that connection again. And I felt that connection in some ways even deeper because I'm able to see the eyelashes. I'm able to see the wind in the hair. I'm able to see things in more detail with the slow motion, with the 4K. 